I offer these every week, along with a short teaching. Just click the subscribe link below to be notified through YouTube when I post the recording of the latest one. Or if you'd like to join me live, which I'd really welcome, go down into the description section below and follow the link along to be able to sign up for free. So help yourself settle in. And I'm going to offer some specific suggestions around posture and the body in the frame of a fundamental and finding a fundamental kindness for your body and yourself altogether in the spirit of the kind of kindness that I saw earlier today in a meeting in which a woman's uh, dog crawled up into her lap during a Zoom meeting and she just was rubbing the dog and petting the dog while doing the meeting perfectly well. Um, can we bring that same approach to our body and our posture to, to support our mind? So you might appreciate the Zen instruction to be soft in the front and firm in the back. Locating your place adjusting your clothing, moving a bit. You can lean back in your chair if that's helpful to you. Sometimes people use little pillows or cushions to find a posture that's stable. can help to have a sense of erectness. One way to imagine this is as if there's a kind of a thread, the very top of your head, pulling it directly upward toward infinity. Whether you're standing or sitting, or walking or lying down. Taking a few particularly big breaths. Feeling your chest expand and your shoulders naturally find a comfortable resting place. your feet and legs coming to stability. Again, a few particularly deep breaths. As you breathe, you might have a sense 
of your chest rising and expanding as you inhale. And then your belly softening as you exhale. Over and over again. Chest rising, belly softening. Staying aware of your body in the present. Changing sensations of breathing. Your hands and arms finding a comfortable position, perhaps resting on your thighs or resting the fingers of one hand on the palm and fingers of the other. Establishing a stable base in your body that supports a stable base of present moment awareness in your mind. Letting yourself become increasingly immersed in the feeling of breathing. Air flowing in and flowing out.
being aware of your whole body as you breathe. immersed in the feeling of breathing, letting go of everything else. Be aware of little trains of thought that come along to carry you away and keep staying in touch with breathing and keep letting go of those trains of thought and not hopping on board. See what it's like simply to abide breathing and aware in the present, continually letting go, letting go of thinking, letting go of planning, letting go of inner language. What's it like simply to be immersed in breathing?
while being aware of breathing, you can let awareness be wide and open, spacious, expansive, vast. Sounds can pass through awareness, occasional thoughts, ongoing sensations of breathing. Letting your mind be increasingly quiet. Staying aware of breathing and letting go of any need to be doing anything else.
If your awareness feels a little dulled, you can sit up straighter, take a bigger breath or two, and keep opening out, opening awareness while staying in touch with breathing. As your mind becomes quieter, you're resting increasingly in awareness. See if you can recognize, even gently invite or encourage, the sense of a, of a lovingness woven into awareness perhaps radiating from the area of your heart, an inherent goodwill for others, wishing them well, a kindness that includes even yourself. A loving awareness opening out from you, spreading in all directions. Moving through you, out and into the world.
abiding as the opening outward. abiding as a loving awareness opening outward. 